So once again, Selena did amazing things in my absence. She's painted the inside of these doors. And you'll notice that it's the same colors all the way through. It's just so beautiful. And look at this. Isn't that just stunning? The kitchen door is done too. Oh, is it really? Yeah, on the inside. I need to go see it. Let's go see the kitchen door. Oh, wow. It just makes the whole place pop so beautifully. A little bit of color. A little bit of color. Color's happy making, man. Yeah, color hey, is man. happy making. Colors make me happy. <laughs> <laughs> the colors make man. They groove me. <laughs> well, it's a little bit. It's crazy outside right now. Far out. You know what is far out to me is that the wind out there is so bad. It's horrible. Yeah. It's horrible and it's cold, and we're sitting in here with no extra heat, just passive solar. And the doors are shut and it's, and, warm. and it's warm and there is no wind well you can't yeah there's no wind and you can't you can hardly hear it and it's if you can get a shot out the window when one of these gusts hit like right now it's just blowing yeah you can see it's blowing pretty hard right now right just a little bit but the gusts are 40 mile per hour wind yes and when i came through i was really worried about the windmills as i came across the yard yeah. Because they were spinning so fast it looked like they were going to try to come off. Well, they fall apart on a regular basis. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Those little cheap dollar store windmills. Yeah. They fall apart on a pretty regular basis. Well, I was basis. talking about the big one in the um, in the garden. Oh, it already broke. Oh, it broke in the tornado. All the fins <laughs> came off of it last No, that's year. the problem. That's the problem then. That's why it's not working right. No. No. I need to put a new... And, and I had already replaced it twice with old fans. The center out of old box fans, but uh, it broke apart again. I I haven't fixed it yet. Yeah, well. it broke apart last spring in the tornado. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that explains it. Yeah, all the fins broke off, and we only found one of them. <laughs> not that the not that that tornado was a no joke motherfucker. Yeah, it was we bad. were on the edge of it. Uh huh. We weren't even in the big ass middle of it. Our place looked like a freaking war zone. All the fins came off that windmill. We found one. Yeah. yeah. That means the rest of them went someplace else. Hopefully not causing any damage. Well, they were plastic. Yeah, they're so not. Hopefully. Yeah, but. I, Heavy plastic, though. Yeah, you've seen, I've seen things go through things like you couldn't believe. But I don't know if you can see the amount of wind or not. I don't know. If I can catch the, the well, stuff on the way back. Well, you're not going to because you know what will happen. It will blow like this. If you look out this back window here, you can see how bad the trees are blowing. That's the sustained wind. Wait a minute. I think it's about to shift. Probably not it's because gonna, I'm filming. No, I can hear it. Yeah. It's going to get... Well, maybe not. Who knows? No, who knows what it's doing. Yeah, it's just nuts. Yeah, but that's how bad it's blowing outside. It's bad. And it's nice in here. That is my point. Yeah. It is crazy bad out there. And the wind is... It looks beautiful. So what I'm telling you is, if you had a small home mm -hmm. and you built it on the ground, because remember, there's air underneath this floor. Mm -hmm. You know, so there's air underneath this floor. But... um yeah, it's, it's sustained winds. If you had a small home and you built it as tight as we made this one, and you know what I built it out of, right. if you've been watching, I built it totally out of garbage. <laughs> it's insulated with old blankets, cardboard boxes, and styrofoam that people threw away. And styrofoam egg cartons. And styrofoam egg cartons. Yeah. And all of that other stuff. And the plastic bag, the plastic in the walls, exterior, interior, are all recycled. Mm -hmm. They were recycled from packing uh, stuff or or uh, build sites or most of it's feed bags. Right, right. There it goes. Oh, wow. You can even hear it probably. Can you see it in the tree? I can see it in the tree. Yes, I can. Wow. Yeah, but we're getting 30 to 40 mile per hour uh, wind gusts and we've got sustained 20 mile per hour winds. Mm -hmm. And the sun's out. This is passive solar, so it's warm in here. Mm -hmm. So, 
There you go. You could build a house like this. <laughs> you could live in this house. Very well. Well, you could probably live in this freaking tree house. Oh, yeah. In fact, I know you could. You could live in this tree house. But it wouldn't be as easy to heat and cool as something on the ground. Exactly, because it's got the air under it as well as so on it's, And it's up in the air and everything right, else. Right. It's like all kinds of stuff that you could get tighter and do better if you were on the ground. Mm -hmm. But yeah. we're way the hell and gone up in a tree, people. Yep. We're at least 20 foot off the ground. It is beautiful. It is beautiful. But it is crazy to watch all that. Yeah. Okay. That is the wind you're hearing, folks. It is crazy out here. The bamboo's going nuts. It looks so beautiful. Getting in out of the wind.